Hi guys and welcome back to another video. My name is Courtney if you don't know me already and I'm from New Zealand but I currently live in Japan but I'm moving to America this year and I love sports so so much so I've been reacting to a whole lot of American North American sports and in today's video I'm going to be reacting to Peyton Manning the sheriff. I was recommended this video a few times so thank you so much to the people who recommended this and yeah let's do it. just the ultimate ambassador that I believe the NFL has ever had. Nobody will argue that Tampa Bay is the best defensive team in football right now. Tampa good are they Bay. historically, John, where would you put this defense? I I don't know if this is the best defense, but I think it's one of the three best defenses ever in this defense. Quarterback. For the most part has really smuggled it. Arguably the greatest regular season quarterback we've ever seen. Okay. Wow. Right promise of Peyton Manning Wait, had been marred by didn't it judgment and just get in intercepted? Right. We're thinking, this is one of the great defenses of all time. Look what they're doing. And then pretty soon, here comes Peyton Manning. And if boom, boom, look what Peyton Manning's doing. And Mungo scores. He's in for the touchdown. First down and touchdown. Here in Indianapolis, Peyton's legacy goes far beyond the football field. Indianapolis Colts are ready to onside kick this one. He epitomizes everything that coaches, executives, anyone associated with the NFL reveals. Perfect high hopper by Vanderjad, and here comes Manning again. They have one. He was just a mythical beast back there, commanding that team down the field. And this is where, you know, all that stuff, calling the play at the line of scrimmage, all those things that Peyton Manning does really pays off here when you get in this, these kinds of situations. So I'm sorry, I'm just like... 85 yards in 101 seconds. Really confused by the first clip where it was intercepted. I don't understand why they put that in there. It's active today. Who would you want in this situation? Do you have a guy that you would pick other than Peyton Manning? We have never, ever, ever thought Peyton Manning was clutch. In fact, the antithesis of that comes to mind. Second and ten. So I'm guessing he was shit at the start. Oh. Seeking the first, getting it, Troy Walters. Manning. I love, I love watching quarterbacks play. <gasps> nice! I love... Um, once basketball watching great decision making football field the bucks in 15 quarters this season have allowed okay and now in the fourth quarter on their home turf they've allowed four no team in the history of the league has won a game after trailing by 21 or more points with fewer than four minutes left in the fourth quarter third down and six Here's the guy wow what a pass is a bullet. Good job. And he's putting it exactly where it has to be. Then if you're going to doink the pipe, you want it to go inside after the doink. Oh, so he kicks as well. Who's your favorite football player then? My dad. Your dad's your favorite football player too? Well, you're on the right track. You're going to be a football player when you grow up? You know, I can remember when Peyton Manning oh, was in college. It's so cute. Ryan Leaf did. I preferred Ryan Leaf because I saw Peyton play live. Where will uh, where will you end up uh, in the NFL, do you think? Is it, is it like, does it work that like the Indianapolis Colts might have a shot at drafting? Peyton Manning, Ryan Leaf, two stars of this year's draft. Certainly the most talked about two quarterbacks in quite a while. So look. Here's the deal. He looks like a really likable like dude. But I will say, if you don't take me, I'm going to kick your butt for the next 15 years. With the uh, first pick of the draft, the Indianapolis Colts. Okay. Quarterback, University of Tennessee, Peyton Manning. Peyton Manning is an icon. Wow, he's... What would you say... He doesn't look Peyton's, too young. Uh, legacy. If I asked you that question, what's your answer to that? 24-7, 365 days a year, he is football. Manning right on the money. That's what they needed, a quick score. And Peyton is going to keep it and go. 
man. I'm just telling you. He's man, running nobody it? Nobody that prepared, that studied more <laughs> than paid. Beautiful vision. Practice, last leave, you know, never takes days off. Man, there is no possible way. That's awesome. This guy has a social life. That's awesome. That's awesome. Right out of the gate. Uh, it's so inspiring. Great quarterbacks playing the game today. You've had a lot of success, and yet you've done it all without a oh, mustache. Oh, that toe tap, no. Not just quarterback right. records, all that stuff. He fills a lot of roles. Boy, he's the best regular season quarterback of all time. Guy who gets gratuitously blown by every answer. Touchdown! Touchdown, Brandon Stokely, his second of the quarter. That angle, though. It's the safety valve, and the man is tearing him up. Brandon Stokely makes the move. You know, you're characterized by people, including me, as the nice. greatest regular season quarterback of all time. He was the greatest regular season football player by far. Passing it around. This time, it's Marvin Harrison. Touchdown, Colts. So easy, mate. That vision, that vision is on point. We all understand points. his greatness. He deserves to be respected. He deserves to be revered. Talking about, you're talking about a guy that's arguably, in my opinion, one of three best quarterbacks to ever put on a uniform in the National Football League. Oh, number 88. Brilliant. Although, I feel like you can't be a good quarterback. Well, it'll be hard to be a great quarterback without a good receiving people. Like, without a good team. Right? Because you could have so much vision and so much... Um, so much knowledge on gameplay and where exactly where people should be going to... For them to throw the ball but if the players on your team don't go there or aren't fast enough or don't have the right timing i don't know what do you guys think or do you think it's up to the quarterback to make sure that the play happens in the early 2000s a rivalry because one team was always winning there were times where Peyton Manning has come up conspicuously short in postseason play which is acknowledging hasn't quite lived up to the billing the marquee in the postseason. Peyton, during the regular season, threw only nine picks. And now he has six interceptions thrown in two and a half playoff games. What, what has happened here? When it's 21-3, I'm thinking to myself, oh my goodness. Then again, it's became the case in the latter half of the early 2000s. Manning led second half comebacks. Touchdown. Comebacks. But... That's not Never good enough. Said Peyton Manning and thought immediately clutch. Rolls out. He has Klecko open and Klecko is in for the touchdown. Oh, their stadium is so cool. They may as well have just made it dumb now. Ben is caught and the game is tied at 21. They come back from 18 down in 11 minutes on the game clock. You know, I don't like teams that make a good comeback because they should be playing to that level throughout the entire game. Move right. Try to plant the feet and fire. Back in the end zone and did it get the feet down? It could be ruled a push out. It is. Touchdown. This could be the drive that would change so many things for Peyton Manning. He falls into an A-Rod Carmelone right. class of top four or five all time, but we've never ever said Peyton Manning and thought immediately clutch. Throwing. Man, Reggie Wayne has the catch at the 31 for a first. He got it. Backpedaling and launching long. Open is Fletcher. Oh, 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 oh. Nice. Good job. He nice feet. Inside the 40. Wayne. Digging in, taking off. Nice footwork, I should say, not in. nice feet. <laughs> oh, 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 lucky, lucky. <laughs> he almost had it. And two from the three, a 
another running play. Don't tell the me they win it. For the touchdown. Oh, so going to the Super Bowl. We have nice. Yeah. The they did win. Ever. In a conference championship game. Okay. I guess you can't game. hate on a comeback at moments like this. Peyton Manning certainly made his case today. He was absolutely perfect. And if the last piece is a championship for Peyton Manning. Miami Dolphin Stadium in Miami, Florida. Super Bowl 41 about to commence. The Super Bowl. And this is such a huge a sporting event. Season covering kicks. It's Hester. When you talk about Def Devin Hester, you're talking about a guy that's a game changer. Oh, the sun has gone down. Devin Hester, you are ridiculous. Does he belong in the Hall of Fame? Absolutely. And here he goes. It's Hester. Inside the 30. Hester's going to take it all the way for a touchdown. He's the fast as hit. that we've ever seen in our generation, the best player in Colts history, including the great Johnny Unitas, doesn't he deserve a statue? Blasphemous. When you say, well, is he the greatest ever? He's in the conversation because of his accomplishments. To see the Colts of Indianapolis win Super Bowl 41. <gasps> oh, that makes me feel cold. He is literally oh, they won it. royalty. He is a walking embodiment of that. He looks so different from when he first got drafted. Oh, that was only part one. Okay, so it was a hard video to really grasp because some people were saying he was amazing and some people were saying that he wasn't that good and he shouldn't be up on that level. Like, he's not the best, but he should be in the conversation because of the things he's done. That doesn't give me much to go off because I'm, I don't know this person and this is the first video I've seen of him so I can't quite grasp what kind of player he was. Um, I think I would have to look more into his history to see what he actually did and more of his plays and things like that. Um, I wasn't super disappointed by his throws and stuff like that. He's got brilliant vision. Um, but yeah, it's hard to grasp his legacy in this video, I think. But thank you so much to the people who recommended this video. I really appreciate it. And if you have any more recommendations, please leave them down below in the comments. And check out my channel to see my playlist. I've got a whole lot of sport reaction videos on there. And apart from that, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.